He's still so determined to deliver this package. Maybe we call help? Nope. What? Uh -huh. What's up, guys? What's up? It is Transilla, and today we are playing a game called Night Delivery. This is a game on Steam from Chills Art. These are the same people who created the convenience store. I think they created Onrio as well. And I have to tell you right now, I already know that this game is gonna be creepy as hell. And that's a fact. Thank you guys for supporting me. I know I've been away for like two weeks, but it's okay. It's okay. You don't cry Boy, no more. You don't, don't, just get on my chest. Come here, come here, come here. Come hither, I got you. Guys, thank you so much for your support. I love you guys. And without further ado, let's get into night delivery. Here we go. Delivery man 31. So this was 31 delivery man men. Use mouse. W-A-S-D for movement. Press left mouse button to interact. Kind of like something that we played before. Oh, whoa. The sensitivity is off the chain. All right, guys. As you can see, we are delivering packages and shit. Can we, like, pick a... This is my last stop. After I deliver these five packages, I am done for today. Deliver this package? Yes, let's do that. We're going to deliver these packages. Because, you know, we are good workers. Psych! We always get our work done. But why the fuck we got to deliver this shit at night? We already had the night shift. We already know what happens when you do shit at night. <laughs> oh, my God! And I don't want to be a night delivery man. Like, what? Especially in Baltimore. So, we got... C. So where is C apartment C at? Bro. Stop playing with me, bro. We just we just started this goddamn game, bro. Like, calm down with the sound effects. <laughs> just just stop. Guys, we are a night delivery man, as you can see. Like, look at this, bro. Just I don't like shit like that. Like, cover up, don't cover up your bike. God, why are we delivering at night? So we need to look for See, bro, another thing, bro. The reason why I do not like doing shit like this is because we seen those little short horror films that you know with where, where take place in areas like this, and it's absolutely scary. We are looking for what uh, what what apartment are we looking for? First of all, let's look at tab room 206 package. So we are looking for 206, it's 202, 203, let's continue to walk down here, something bad is going to happen, like it is dark as shit here, shit look like Acon ankles, 206, knock on door, doorbell intercom, um, let's just knock on the door, uh, just leave the package there and just go away, alright, we're going to use the doorbell intercom. Why do you gotta make sure that they get that package? You knocked already. Man, can we like drop, how you drop that package? This, his mail thing is taped up. Whoa! Stop fucking playing with me, bro. You look like Sue Young, uh, dad for Rush Hour. <laughs> uh, you took way too long. Get the hell up out of my face. I wish a motherfucker would on my shift throw a water bottle in my face. Who I look like, Justin Bieber? Oh hell no! That 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 was a that was Rapsies right there. I would have sit there and really got fired because I would have been fighting the customer. It is too dark to be delivering packages alone. And why is my door open now? I'm pretty sure it was closed when I grabbed the first package. Can we like grab all the packages at once? We have package B now. And package B is for room 502. So like 
What, bro? He said you are, bro. Chill with that, Ted. Chill with that shit. Fix that. But he gonna sit there and say I'm too late. Like what? In the stop fucking playing with me. In the description before I deliver this package, it tells you, like, hey, it could come from 7 a.m. to 8 p.m. So I'm gonna let you know. When I deliver these packages, you gotta calm down real quick. I ain't playing no games. I smack a motherfucker. Ah! So that's 301. So we have to go higher. What the fuck? Ew. Somebody dirty? They got all these damn trash bags. I was gonna use the stairs. I guess we gotta use the elevator. Here come the elevator. Bro. This shit is not comfortable. Hold on, let's back the fuck up before somebody open up this and throw a water bottle at my face. What type of elevator? Bro, this is not good. What the hell? What type of elevator only can fit one person inside there? I got this box. I swear to God, I will launch the... The pack is right in the customer face or anything that tries to kill me. Oh my god. It shouldn't have trash bags around that spot. Was it 502? Yes! We're gonna knock. Why is that thing taped up? Just leave it in front of that door. Damn, girl. You look like you belong in Tekken with your fine ass. Thanks. I have a reward for your great service. That's what you gonna do? Give me that good good? Um, hell no, you're not getting no good good from me. <laughs> you love cats too, don't you? Depending on what kind of cat you talking about. Boy, if you don't- Um, I'm talking about cat food, you nasty freaky fuck. <laughs> Take it and be gone. She gave me fucking cat food. Y'all might be the weirdest fucking customers that I've ever delivered anything to. You giving me a, some cat food for a reward? Yes! That's just disrespectful. I just feel like I should slap that ass before I left. Ah, that bro, I don't like that. Take it and be gone? Are you serious? Yes! Like, you're rude. What type of customer are you? I don't like shit like that. Bro, <laughs> I'm not fucking playing. Pack is D. Let's go to, uh, let's... Ah! Oh my god! <laughs> What the fuck is that sound behind me? I don't like that. Oh my god. Deliver this package. Yes, please. All right, let's see. Uh, 401. Okay, package 401. We are doing good so far. Let's use the elevator. Oh my god. Get your ass on that elevator. Oh my god. Go. I don't like this. I don't like this shit. I'm telling you right now, I know something bad is going to happen. What the fuck is that? Are you? Bro. Close that shit. Close that shit. They got trash bags and shit in front of the elevator part. All them trash bags. Y'all landlord don't got nothing, no problem with that? So we got to go all the way to the top level to get the four. Yes! And I find that very disgusting. Look at this shit, bro. Like, look at this. This shit look like Baltimore Projects. 401. Is this 401? Yeah, this 401 right here. Go here. Knock on the door. I ain't fucking playing, y'all. What type of people is that? It's from Silent Hill? What the fuck? I, I'm scared. Am I the only one? Aren't you scared too? This whole place, it's like I'm becoming a part of it. I am just the delivery man. I am not the fucking police. Don't tell me anything you're scared of while I'm delivering my package. You're trying to scare me. Never mind. Forget about it. I, I forget about it. I'm not even worried about it. Like, don't tell me about your shit. That's your shit. Man, shut your ass up. You want this package or not? Oh, me? I haven't left my room in, uh... I don't know. I stopped counting. Oh, right. You're here for the package. Don't know if I can tr trust you in your parcel yet. Listen, 
You don't have to fucking trust me, my guy. You don't have to trust me. Just take your goddamn package. I'm going to leave it by your door. Yeah, that's cool, bitch. First of all, don't disrespect me because you got your door cracked. I will go get the same body ah. that the other guy threw at me and throw it at your ass. Talk to the priest. He says he live in apartment number 105. Why do I got to talk to a priest just to deliver your goddamn package? Talking about talk to a goddamn priest. First of all, why y'all got a priest living around here? That shit making me a little scared. I don't like this shit. I'm gonna let you know this shit right now. I, I don't like this shit. I shouldn't have to talk to a priest to deliver your package, my guy. I shouldn't have to do that. If I gotta do that, then that means that you're crazy and that package is gonna be left right in front of your door. You don't gotta trust me. Just grab your package when you ready. How about you tell the priest to deliver your package? <laughs> Tell that goddamn priest to deliver your package. And it's 105, they said. Like, yo, stop playing with me with that shit, bro. Gotta talk to a goddamn priest in order to deliver your package. I'm about to tell the priest to deliver your shit. What the fuck? This, huh? I see Mitchell sent you here. I'm the local priest. Why do they have a local priest? <laughs> Look what's going on in this apartment. Say no more. I can sense that the package is cursed. What? Tell off to my little friend. The package is cursed? Hold the fuck on. Why do I got a cursed package? But I need to make an offering first. An offering for what? My, like, just take this package and you do the offering shit with the guy upstairs on the fourth floor. Before I can perform any sanctifications on this object, monetary that is, tis, 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 I need cash. You need cash? Struggle! So what are we supposed to do? Don't tell me we are supposed to give this man some fucking cash. Yes. So like, maybe the guy can give me some cash to handle that? Yes. My guy, can you give me some cash? You spoke to the pr pr priest? Yes. Directly? Yes. How lucky are you? I've only exchanged words through the door intercom. So he needs money. Yeah. Why, of course. What the priest says is always right. Here, give this to him. Make sure that he gets it ASAP. I don't want the priest to wait any longer. Okay, so he gave me some money, and why am I carrying the money like this? This must be some heavy ass money. You gotta pay money for them to basically exercise this package? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> I would have, man, I would have launched this motherfucking package like a football. You can run too in this game. So you already know that's a bad thing from jump. What's up, man? Got your money. Let me double check the amount. He's the most unholy priest ever. <laughs> hey, man, time is money, and I fought with Mr. Krabs. <laughs> what? Tis, tis, tis. This can't possibly be enough. Does Machiro think he can really get away with this? Ask Machiro to bring me more. What? I hate being the person who runs back and forth for you guys. Handle that shit. Fix that shit yourself. Something's gonna happen with me traveling back and forth like this. You hear that can that, that can and shit in the background? Yes. I'm running into the wall and shit. Like I shouldn't have to run back and forth. To this guy. Hey, he says not enough. What? It it wasn't enough? Forgive me, priest. I hope this will help. This is all I've got for this month. I have to ask my parents to give me more. He should have gave me that whole amount at the beginning. I shouldn't have to run up and down these goddamn stairs and and do this shit. What the hell? I thought I just fell through the goddamn wall. <laughs> all right, so let's take this to the priest, and it should be enough now. If he says not enough, I'm smacking that priest. All right, Mr. Miyagi. Here you go. <laughs> hmm, let me double check the amount. Wait. Oh, that's enough. Barely, that is. Tis, 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 tis. I'll forgive him this time. He's so 
fucking Mr. Crab like. Let us begin the ritual. Um, I'm gonna leave the package to you. You begin that shit by yourself. Done. You didn't do nothing. Only thing you did was kiss the package. <laughs> Shut the fuck up and tell him I sanctified this package for him. An old guy gotta make money too. Ah! You slapped the shit out of me with that door. <laughs> this priest is a priest from the hood. <laughs> what is going on? I should have to go through all these obstacles to deliver this small ass package. What's inside here? By doing all this, I would have probably peeked this out in the package. I ain't even gonna lie. All right, it should be no BS now. I got your shit. We good now. I made sure I baptized your package. Here you go. Forgive me, priest. I'm ready to take the package now. Now go away. Like, why is everybody so fucking mean here? Imagine being a delivery guy. And somebody saying the package is cursed. First of all, I'm suing UPS. That package took a long time to deliver. All right, so we got two more packages. Let's grab the big box, and then we're going to get that box. Man, you are going to die. And what package is this? 305. Yes. Why is the package so small? Like, I sworn I picked up a big-ass package. But we are going to ignore that shit because that's none of our business. <laughs> 303. 305. Knock on the door. Back up in case somebody got water bottles. No. No. Freaking way. Yup. Let's go back to our truck. Fuck this. Why do I gotta go in here, bro? Like, why Why do I gotta do this shit? Hello? UPS? Let the door close by. Bro, you done fucking goofed, bro. You done freaking goofed. You done freaking goofed. I'll be right there. Fuck this. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my fucking god! Oh my god, I can't take this shit! What, you crazy bitch, you! What are you doing? That package. It's a bed frame. You're gonna help me build it, right? No. Bitch, do I look like that type of guy? Yes. I mean, the booty look kind of good. If, if I mean, maybe if the booty good, I can like help you. Can I, can I get a happy ending? <laughs> no, nigga. This bitch gonna slap the shit out the back of my head. Set up bed frame. What type of delivery guy am I? Bro. Get the fuck out of here. Where's my flashlight? Fuck no. That is blood. Oh my. Oh my god. What the hell? Who's bleeding? Oh, no, fuck this. Why am I still looking around? Let's get the hell up out of here. Leave. What the freak? Oh, my God. What? Oh, yeah, we... Oh, my God! Package A. Grab it. He's still trying to deliver it. Okay, employee of the year, SpongeBob head ass. I'm ready. I'm ready. 202. We don't gotta do much with this package. Just go upstairs. Oh my freaking goodness. 201. Stop playing with me. 
He's still so determined to deliver this package. What the hell that was just now? <laughs> but your son just ran down the hallway. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I thought this little motherfucker opened up the door. <laughs> motherfucker looked like an Asian Chucky. <laughs> hey, what's up, miss? My baby. You have to help me catch him. Why do I gotta catch your baby? What the freak? What type of shit is this? Open up the cat food. Give it to the baby. Here go the water bottle. Let's take the water bottle. What the hell? Bro. Oh, here go the cat. Oh, give it to the cat. What's this? Kohei, how are you doing? How's the new apartment? In the previous apartment, you had to move because the residents there weren't so kind to you. Is it okay this time? Before, there were people who made a fool of themselves about disabilities and welfare, right? I said it many times before. You weren't the bad one. Don't blame yourself. Also, don't be impatient about getting a job, Kohei. You are my son. You'll be okay. Things will get better. Mom. So, I don't know what that was about. I can't believe this shit, bro. I'm fucking dead, bro. <laughs> Why do I gotta catch your son? Do I look like I'm, I am run a daycare? Man, let's check up on the fourth floor. Where that cursed room at. Because I bet you the baby went inside of that cursed room. Let's get his baby a water bottle or something. Maybe that's what he wants, some water. Maybe he was just gonna go get some Doritos or something. Alright, so let's go down to the apartment that had the blood there. Even though I don't understand how the baby make it past all those trash bags if I couldn't. And not to mention, if the baby used the elevator... That's not a baby no more. That's a grown ass man. <laughs> I bet you he went in here, bro. I bet you he went in here. I bet you he went in here. What is this ambience? What the freak? What is this ambience? What? What? Maybe if I see Baby Shark do 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 <laughs> Okay, they didn't like that. Baby Shark do 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 Baby Shark do 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 ah. Like, why is this pop right here? Uh, I am so sorry. That lady gonna kill the shit out of me. And why is there pictures of a fridge? Maybe the baby is inside of the refrigerator? Put his ass in the refrigerator! Go inside here. Is What? Stop fucking playing with me. Oh my god, those pictures are here now. What the freak? Get your ass here! Uh, 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 uh. Tore that goddamn baby head up! Get your ass here! Bro, hold the baby. Just hold the baby because when something about to kill you, you got the baby as a human shield. Freak is you talking about? Yeah. You going right down to your mama and she better whip your ass right in front of me. Yeah, get your head stuck out of the elevator. 
Yeah, as the floors go down, do 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 do. That's what's happening to your head right now. What the hell? It was like a silhouette. I didn't know you was part black. <laughs> yep. What? What? Where's the baby? I just picked up a demon child. This is also Silent Hill PT type shit. No way. No way. What? Grab all the packages. So let's try to deliver the money to the priest first. What's this? This morning I saw Yukichi in room 105. He seems to be a priest and I thought that he was a kind person. So I went to talk. What is this weak person doing? I don't want to see it just useless without money. Never show up in front of me ever again. He said maybe he was in a bad mood. So I'm guessing that we get the packages and drop them off. Yes. But we have to use these ladders to get to where we need to get at. So let's see what our first package is going to be. We're going to start with room uh, two. We're going to go for the twos now. So let's do this one. Uh, let's see, 202. Right here. Let's look at this one. Diary one. The baby was walking outside this morning. He is adorable. That is Mariko's child in room 202. As soon as Mariko noticed me looking at her son, she grabbed her son and took him inside the house. Please stay away from my son. Am I like a germ to her? So these neighbors were really freaking mean like for what like if they don't want nobody to see that son or whatever don't have that son outside i was like girl you better calm down nobody was looking at your stupid ass son i throw back at you and your son <laughs> that's just me <laughs> 306 now climb down one more time and we should be at 206 okay there we go there we go okay 206 at night, Mr. Taiko in room 206 was carrying a box filled with beer cans. I said, do you mind me helping you? Why the fuck are you trying to help? If you have time to help, you shouldn't be on welfare. You're just a burden to society. Damn! Who the fuck <laughs> That man went in on him. <laughs> what? I wonder if people around me think that way. What? Man, you would have got your ass whipped talking to me like that. I don't give a fuck about this job like that. All right, here we go. Room 305. Interact with the room. Like, what? Oh, right, there we go. Okay, what the hell? I literally had to spam that in order to get that to work for me. All right, let's look at this. Diary 3. Arissa in 305 is a student. She is also a part-timer at the nearest convenience store. I can tell she is a hard worker and I respect that. When I thought she wouldn't say hello when we passed each other, to the first time this morning she said, Are you stalking me? Bro, what are you talking about, man? You ugly fuck. I wasn't stalking. Hold on, yo. Why everybody here is so bitter and mean? Alright, full one. Here we go. You gotta spam this shit like 400 times just to get this shit to work. There you go. Okay. Okay, we had to spam that a couple times. I thought I could get along with Mature Son in room 401 since we were close in age. i never seen him out his room. I decided to visit him. He finally came out for the third time. I don't think anyone can get along with someone like you. He said, that's it. The door closed immediately. And that's the guy who wanted to give us hell when we was going to deliver his package. I wouldn't want to be friends with y'all motherfuckers anyway. Weirdos. All right, 502. 50 freaking 2. Right here. Bruh, the elevator works now. We're gonna die. Like, something's gonna happen. You really think things is gonna go that easy? So maybe the elevator is like some kind of thing that takes you to a different dimension, maybe? I mean, that's all I got from it. 
So maybe that's why we need to make it back to the elevator. If something don't grab us before we do it. Maybe we call help? Nope. What? Uh, ah! <laughs> 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 that scared the fuck out of me. <laughs> oh my god. This woman ain't getting her baby back. Are we on the second floor? Yes! Okay. This woman ain't getting her baby back. Take your goddamn child. What? She took her child so fast and threw me out after all I went through? Get your ass back to your truck. What? Deliver this package? What package is this? Man, they about to deliver us. And what room is this? 404. I don't like investigating around the building, but I feel like I should. And here goes a key. It's the mailbox 404. Oh, here it go right here. So 404. Let's look at 404. Where you at? Right here. What's that? Uh. Kohei, are you okay? I haven't heard from you, so I wrote a letter again. You tend to get depressed since you were a kid easily. Don't care too much about your disability. I'm worried, Kohei. Sometimes the depression accumulates and explodes. Kohei, you are kinder than anyone I know, and remember that I'm proud of you. Call me anytime if anything happens. Dad and I'll always be on your side. Work, you don't have to force yourself to work, you know. By the way, Grandma wants to see your face. Come back home sometime, okay? Mom. That's kind of sad. So everybody was mean to this man. And this man was, like, nice and he had a disability. And they was just mean to his ass. So instead of me dying as the delivery guy, somebody else should die. The neighbors should die. Jesus Christ. Because I don't understand why this man is haunting me. When I was the nice guy. I was delivering the packages. I'm just here doing my job. So you don't have to kill me because of what they did. That's just fucked That's fucked up. I just don't understand the concept of killing me for their mistake. I didn't know they was doing it. If I did, I would have stopped them. Kohei, don't kill me, okay? Guys, I try not to be loud when playing scary games now because we moved and we got neighbors. And I'm like, yo, I'm trying not to scream, bro. But how can you not scream when some shit like this happened? Don't be knocking on your door. I'm supposed to be doing the knocking. I'm the delivery guy. Knock on door. Kohei. Please be. This man about to scare the fuck out of me. Here we go with this shit again. After all he went through, he's still gonna do shit like this? Kohei, kill him. Kill him right quick. This is the refrigerator that, that was inside that picture. Kill him right quick, Kohei. Co oh my god. What? I've seen too much. I've seen way too much. 
He killed that person. I feel like I've seen too much. I can't even, I don't even know where to go. This shit is like TV static. Hey, I might as well sit next to you because I'm next to die, right? Yes! Okay, so I might as well die next to you then. <laughs> I don't know what to say. <laughs> All right, <laughs> let's see what goes on here. That we are the landlord. What? So we are the landlord now. As the landlord, what are we supposed to do? Are we supposed to go check 404? Yes! Oh, you are so fucking dead. What? What the freak? Oh my god, those feet oh need soap god. and water and lotion. What? We got ending two. All right, y'all. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Uh, this was night delivery. It was a good game. I got nothing to say bad about it. It was scary. And I like the way how everything built it up to that one scale. It was just waiting for me. <laughs> I'm going to leave the game inside the description if you guys want to play it. Hopefully you guys enjoy playing it. But I love you guys and until next time, peace out. You win. Perfect.